The Commission, in preparation, has scheduled a two-day retreat on the 27th and 28th of this month, wherein an internationally renowned police expert on vetting is expected to advise the Commission, and in attendance will be the Independent Policing Oversight Authority. We'll also have judges and the magistrates vetting board represented to assist us in improving on the tool, the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission, and so the vetting of police officers in the service is expected to begin in June when we are carrying out the interviews for those two categories I have mentioned, the directorates at the police headquarters and the county commanders. Identifying competencies that will assist us and the National Police Service for proper placement, for training, and for purposes of looking at people who hitherto may have been forgotten and yet they need to have been pro properly placed. That is the reason for this vetting exercise. So I want to call upon police officers, and that is called the Commission's view, to feel comfortable, to feel ready, to look forward to vetting, because all police officers in the service, beginning from the top all the way to the bottom, will be vetted.